Okay, so our bangs are better and my hair is about an inch and a half shorter, which for long hair like mine, just whatever. <clears throat> but uh, that only took like 25 minutes and I have a nail appointment at 1230. Look at these things. They need updated. And then I have a birthday party that I'm attending. I'm going to be a little late because my appointment is on the other side of town at 1230. But it starts at 1. But I'm just getting a color change on a full manicure. And that usually only takes like 20-something minutes. <clears throat> um, so that'll be good. Uh, but I need to get ready now because on that same side of town where I'm getting my nails done is the store and I want to get a um <clears throat> I want to get a couple things and including a card and a gift card to go out to eat for the person whose birthday it is <sighs> yeah also I have a meal replacement shake that's what I need. Okay, so we are going to get these brows figured out. My bangs are no longer going to be in my eyebrows. And my hair is going to be a couple inches shorter with the dead ends taken care of. Um, I'm at the salon now. And I have three minutes to spare. Woo! It took a long time to scrape off my car because of the ice underneath it. Okay, uh, I look really dramatic, especially for going to Walmart. My dress isn't as good as it could be because I do still have on my thermal shirt because it is still uh, below 20 degrees out. I also have, this is the mask that I'm going to wear uh, because it's a masquerade themed birthday. Um, and I have some tape with me because I'm going to tape the gift card to it. So I'm going to go buy the gift card and... Get to the store and then I'm hoping if I go to my nail appointment a little early, they'll be able to get me in because my nail caught on everything. My hair net, my wig, every piece of clothing I have on, everything. This catch these nails are catching on everything and it's driving me nuts. <sighs> Alright, so the makeup is off and we're on our way to the gym. I have my sneakers and what I'm changing into my gym bag I need to get to the gym so that I can get set up again um, to go out for a little bit this evening I'll get signed up at the club for our drawings and I need time to be able to stop and grab um, a bottle of wine gift for our friend and make her a birthday card yeah, I've been, like, trying to hurry to get to the gym. Okay, so I ended up being a little late to the party because the nail place was, like, 20 minutes behind, 25 minutes behind. So I just texted the host and said, I'm going to be late, but I'm still showing up. And she was like, that's fine. So the the birthday party went well. They had It's a Mardi Gras theme party, like I said. So they had little crowns and masks and... They were handing out things that says, I may be wrong, but I doubt it. And there was also like sip sip hooray and stuff like that. And they also did like word scramble, word search that were Mardi Gras themed and everything like that. And they also were handing out like candy bars. So I had a piece of king cake and then a piece of regular cake. <laughs> And, uh, yes, now I'm home again. And while I was there, some people were like, oh, we're going back out tonight a little after 6 to celebrate so-and-so's birthday that's tomorrow. And I was like, okay, I'll show up for that too. Okay, I just got home. I didn't plan on being out late. I didn't drink or anything. I put on a headband. Um, I have on some tea, and I'm getting ready to eat. I am not sponsored, by the way. Uh, this is from Daily Harvest, and this is the butternut squash and rosemary pureed soup. So there's no broth in this, 
but it has all this stuff supposed to be really healthy um which is good because what I ate today was a piece of birthday cake, a cupcake, and a cinnamon roll, which was like a king's cake, a little slice of that, and two meal replacement chicks. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and heat this up. So this is what this looks like frozen, fresh out of the thing. This is the um, butternut squash and rosemary. So here's the butternut squash, and then here's like all of the... I guess spices, herbs, and stuff. And then three minutes later, you take it out, give it a stir, and depending how hot it is, you can pop it in for another minute or two, but this is pretty hot, so it's good enough for me. And it's 200, this thing is 200 calories. Also, I had some old wine, red, white wine, and so instead of cinnamon and oranges I use lemon whole cloves and put that in here for a mulled white wine for a nice hot January drink okay so I have my lovely candle and I'm going to replace my stuff because I use the like Walmart or equate version of this and I think this has been making my contacts weird and has been affecting my eyes I have my favorite towel, um, turby wrap, and I'm going to have my mulled wine in a nice relaxing bath, bubble bath. Self-care to the max, baby. Ready for a relaxing evening, so join me, get yourself a drink of your choice, and relax on the bed. Here we are, I think, at face masks were designed for people with round faces as opposed to long faces like my own and I'm just here I have my feet elevated laying in my robe gonna enjoy the rest of my wine some Emily D. B. just really lay down and relax I've had such a busy day I'm not going to bed quite soon um I'll probably be up for uh, three or four more hours um, got a lot done today. So, you know, I hope that you get a chance to relax with a face mask and drink of your choice. I also used a ton of Snow Fairy body lotion on my feet. I don't know about you guys, but my heels just feel like they cannot get enough hydration. Okay, it's time to say good night. Um... If I do anything else tonight, I'll be playing video games with my Discord friends. But I'm actually already cozy in the bed and <laughs> clearly getting sleepy. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this, but today when I'm recording is January 14th. So it's most likely when I post this last week. But I felt like I had a really good thing of balancing social obligations and um, self-care stuff like that and actually truly taking time to relax after what was really a poopy week at work and everything else so i hope that you all have a good martin luther king jr day weekend i'm leading up if you don't have the day off i hope you have a good day and yes i will see you in the next videos and also um completed uh, one of my partial new year's quests one of my monthly ones i did make a donation to Doctors Without Borders. I'm not here to try to make a, like a political statement or brag. I'm just saying it was one of my um, New Year's resolutions or quests to donate um, every month. And so that I'm just marking that down for posterity. Uh, yes. So I hope that you have a good time and I will see you in the next video. <laughs> Bye humans. I hope you have all of the health and happiness that you need. Mm -hmm.